Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. This morning I'm going to show you a mini makeover in my bathroom. I recently picked up a new shower curtain from Target. It's a, it was a black and white stripe and I really loved it. And it's kind of um, prompted a little decor change in my bathroom and I thought I would show you some of the changes I've made. So let's get started. Okay, so today's project is cleaning and organizing my bathroom. So this is the main bathroom, it's not very big. As you can see, I already took down the shower curtain because I have a new one. And then I need to clean, give everything a good spruce up. And then these shelves over here, I need to reorganize. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Like the decorative things I'm kind of bored with, so I need to switch things around. And then look at that, just craziness. All this clutter. So, that is my goal for today. So this is what the room is looking like right now. Off to the right, we've got the mirror and the vanity, and then the stool. And then in the corner, I have some shelves that I built in, oh, probably five years ago. And then next to that, we've got some hooks, and then into the shower. So this is a new shower curtain that I got, and I absolutely love it. It's got like a faded stripe and then it's got like a stitch stripe and I just love it. I think it's very classic looking and very pretty and I like the simplicity of it. So that is the new shower curtain. And then over in the vanity area, I keep things very simple because I have three girls and this counter space is like prime real estate. So we keep it as clear as possible. We put a little thick of soap and then we've got some little cups for the girls when they brush their teeth and then I bought this marble um, toothbrush holder not too long ago and I absolutely love it and then over on this little wall here we've got a hook that holds a towel because there really isn't any good place in here for um, for hanging you know towels to wipe your hands off with and then above it I have a few prints and a plate so that is the vanity area and then over here, above the stool, I added a basket with some washcloths in it, so they're within easy reach. And then I have a couple prints which I want to eventually um, switch out for something different, but I don't have anything at the moment. And then that leads us to the shelving area. Now I put, when I first moved into this house, I didn't know what to do with this like dead space, and then I'm like, oh, I could put shelves in there. So I backed it with beadboard and then I put built some shelves that go in there and it makes perfect sense for this little space and we get a lot more storage and of course displaced shelf. So right here I added a chalkboard and a little white mirror in front of it and then I have a white linen diffuser which makes the room smell very pretty and then of course a vintage clock because I like my vintage clocks and then on the next shelf down and again I have another print that I think I'll change out but I need to figure out what to do with that I really don't have anything in black and white print wise so that's something I need to look for and then I use this little silver um, basket to corral the kids hair ties and such and then I added this really cool sort of industrial looking candle holder on the side and then uh, over here I added a little boxwood plant that I just picked up at Michael's the other day and then a little black and glass candle holder and then the next shelf down another print that needs to be replaced and then I got these little baskets that we've had them for a while from well, no, wait, Target, these are from. Um, they're just plastic little totes and they work perfect for taking care of the kids' makeup clutter. So that's one of my daughter's makeup collection. Then this little creamer, we normally have Q-tips in, but we're out right now, it's on the shopping list. And then I have this little platter right here for my other daughter who is obsessed with these lip glosses and then she uses eye drops every morning and then has her deodorant on it too because she doesn't really have a space right now that's just her own so this was a kind of a nice way, little way for her to have her own little space 
And then down on the next shelf is another basket from Target. And that's got all of their face cleansing, their perfumes, their hair products, that kind of stuff. And then on the other side of the shelf is a little pyramid of toilet paper because that's necessary. And then down below I added a black basket with a liner that's also striped to use as a laundry basket. So there you go. That's the room I'm really liking the way it looks right now and I think it's a cute little, I mean it was seriously took me less than a half hour to update a few things so and give it a whole new look. So there you go. That is the newly decorated bathroom. I really like how it turns out. I'm loving black and white right now, so this is like perfect. So I hope you enjoyed the tour, and thanks so much for stopping by. If you would like, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.